Oh, what's going on guys? Clutter of 12, and yes, I was on my phone before the dice let that's why River City is beating my ass right now. Play WWE 2K18, no more WrestleMania matches just now, I'm afraid. WrestleMania is over with, the hype is long gone by two weeks before these videos are going to be out, but scheduling issues with myself, just myself really, getting time and things like that. I've done the videos, so I hope you guys enjoy them, I really do. We're going to be back to our old nonsense me doing random matches that will never ever happen because unfortunately some superstars are no longer with us. Um, this is going to be very late news by the time it comes out. But this is not going to affect many people, I don't know if many people have seen them. But EPW, today is the 7th of April, they suffered a loss. They lost one of their champions. They lost Killjoy the Clown. Now sure, many people have never ever heard of Killjoy the Clown. Heck, I've only ever, I only saw him compete a couple times. Never met the guy personally, never part of seeing him in the ring and being in the front row and kind of being the distance from one from a camera from him. I've never, I never had a chance to meet the guy or see him in a backstage or, because I've been to some of the VIP things and one of the guys I've never actually got to meet. But he was a, a great part of EPW. A lot of the guys, uh, Joe Rage and what's his, what's the other guy called him? I know the guy I'm trying to think of. He was a, a luchador when I saw him, but he's no he's no longer with EPW either. I think don't even think Joe Rage with EPW anymore. But the the both guys is on today on uh, Instagram and things like that has paid their own tribute to Killjoy the Clown, and I hope he he's. What can you say when someone dies? I mean, fair enough, I've, I never met the guy. Not a real cheer video, I know, but still, and a, young, a, a really young wrestler that had a, could have an amazing career, could have got two places that someone would never have done. What, and you mean, he's not much older than me, and I mean, I'm not old, I don't wrestle anything like that, but no matter what he did, he, he meant a lot to many people. He, his family, thoughts go with them, and all that, you know. Hopefully, they're fat. You can't say anything. No, that's a weird twist of the video, but it happened today. They also, EPW also lost one of their, their ring announcers again. I met him a couple of times, spoke to him. He was a really nice guy, but unfortunately, these things happen. I don't really want to talk about it much because it's a real dampener, and I just wanted to say my piece, you know, I, that people are going to miss Killjoy, the clown, entertaining them, and being being a crazy clown and even with the announcer guy whose name I skip, skips my mind now he always wore a green suit at the shows and I feel horrible from not remembering his name right now but that's multiple guys in the last well two people in the last week that from EPW has sadly passed away and thoughts and prayers with their families and their friends and everyone like that that's all you can say really I mean I wish I had a bigger audience so I could kind of Shine a light on these guys and kind of. Oh, we're out with the rumble. Thank you, Bram. I met you twice, Bram. You bought me a pint. <laughs> Sorry, but yeah. I met Bram with EBW as well. Uh, it's like I said, I've met a few of the guys from EBW and bought to go with them as well. The families, their friends, all the. Just, it's a shame when someone's life comes to an end, especially at such a young age. At any age. Look, age, but you know what I'm saying. So unfortunately that's been happening, that's been the wrestling news that affects me really, it doesn't really affect me, I don't know the guy, but you know what I mean. WWE news is worldwide, EPW is a UK promotion, I don't, I don't know if they've done any tours overseas but they've been all over the UK, I know that much. And thoughts and prayers are with everyone they touched in their lives and made their lives better, you know. Not much more I can say than that, Brother than... Rey Mysterio and Matt Seidel, I haven't born in the last two in this rumble, I got it pretty early on. Can't believe the smallest man got rid of Ev uh, the Great Khali as well, but sort of that, that, uh, un -norm that not normal kind of level of enthusiasm for me, but unfortunately it happened and I wanted to kind of say, say a piece about it, well, it wasn't really a piece, but let people know that there's wrestling promotions that very few people get to see because they're on the small scale. The guys that work there are so dedicated and so willing to put a show on and make everyone in that crowd enjoy it and have a good time. 
whether the bad guys or the good guys, if you do see a local wrestling show anywhere near you, even if they don't have a big name going to, please, please do go see them. Please give them your support. Please give them your enthusiasm. Be in the crowd. Have fun with it. Don't be a jackass, but you know, you know what I mean. Have fun, enjoy it, and the wrestlers enjoy it too, and they give you a way better show. The worst thing you can ever do at a wrestling show is do nothing. Just sit there. Don't, if you don't clap, you don't cheer, you don't try and get anyone, don't try and get the good guy pipe. Kimmy, click, clap your hand, try and get the good guy encouraged or boo the bad guy. Wrestlers are, to them, the show is getting a reaction from the crowd. Whether it be good or bad, if the crowd isn't willing to participate, the wrestler loses, doesn't have the same sort of effect. They could lose that edge that gives them them because the crowd isn't behind them. I mean, WWE is totally different. I'm fair enough, I've never been to a WWE event personally, I'm not going to say I have, but I've been to loads of small promotions and things like that like six seven different shows and the crowd really does when they get behind them and get into it and really give it their all to be entertained and make noise you can see on the wrestlers that they're loving it every moment of it and when you're quiet and do nothing but sit there you can see they think they're not doing a good enough job to entertain you but i have rambled on long enough does the prayers go with kills with the clown and the announcer, the guy that I seriously can't remember the name on, I feel so bad for that. Let's go with the friends and family. Yes, it's going to be a late update for me, but better late than never, and I hope everyone doesn't forget them, but everyone remembers them for who they were and what they gave to the show and all the people that entertained. So I thank you guys for watching this WWE 2K team video, and I'll see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching this WWE 2K18 video. If you see more wrestling videos from me, click that first playlist. If you want to see a video that YouTube has picked just for you, click that second playlist. If you want to see more videos from me, click that subscribe button.